When I was in the UK, one of the mashayikh there, he was sharing his story with us. And I heard it personally, and it's a very famous story. Just to give you an example, one of the mashayikh there, he says, I was hired by one of the masajid as an imam. He says, I was hired as, as an imam by one of the mosques. He says that I was new to the area. And really, I, 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 this is a true story, so I really want you to really live it out, yeah? He says I was the Imam, and I used to take the bus from my house to the town, to, to, to that area, and then I would walk to the masjid, it wasn't far from there. He says, so I would take this bus. He says, one day I jumped on the bus, and uh, it was a new bus driver, so it wasn't someone that, that he had seen. He says, I jumped on the bus, I paid him for my fare, and he gave me the change. He says, when he gave me the change, I didn't really look at what he gave me until I went back to the back of the bus, I sat down. He says, when I sat down, I looked at the money and I realized he gave me 20 pence. In the UK, 20 pence, yeah, and we're talking nothing, but cents, like 10, 10 cents at most. He says, so you know, like I sat there and I said, man, the guy gave me more. He said, and then the conversation started happening in my head. And honestly, how many times have you been in this position? He's thinking, you know what? It's 20 pence. It's nothing, bro. Don't worry about it. You know what I mean? Don't embarrass yourself. They're a big company anyway, bro. And really, what's 20 cents going to do? Eh? So the man's sitting there and he's thinking, bro, it's 20 cents. Should I? Shouldn't I? Should I? Shouldn't I? He says, and wallahi, for the whole trip, this is the conversation that's happening. He says, you know, like it wasn't about the money. It was just... And then the Sheikh was saying, he was saying, when I got to my bus stop, he said, when I got to my destination, he said, I got off my chair, I'm walking down the bus, I'm walking to the front door. He says, well, and I'm still saying to myself, do I give it, then I give it? He says, and then as soon as I got to the bus driver, he said, I don't know what went into me, man. He said, when I turned over the bus driver, I said to him, look, man, you gave me 20 extra. He goes, no, I didn't give you 20 extra. He goes, I gave it to you intentionally. He said, why did you give it to me intentionally? He goes, well, for three years, I've been looking into Islam. And he said, when I came and I seen you dressed the way you were dressed, I knew that you were an Imam. He said, so today I was going to make my decision. If you were honest, if you were honest, I was going to embrace Islam. But if you kept that money, I, he said, I knew that you were liars like everyone else lies. So now the Sheikh is speaking about himself. He says, I gave him the money. He says, I got off the bus. He says, when the bus drove off, he says, I started crying. I said to him, why? Because the man accepted Islam or who's was about to accept Islam, he gets me, la wallahi la. I said to him, why? He said to me, I almost sold my deen for 20 cents, bro. He said, I almost sold Islam. I sold the deen of Allah Azza wa Jal for 20 cents.